Walker, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Noomi, and in today's video, we are back with another Roblox video. So in today's video, I'm going to be showcasing Marvel Girl in a game called Heroes Beta 2.0. You know what, I showcase this game too much to, like, for you guys to not know about it. Uh, but yeah, I'm gonna be showcasing Marvel Girl. The reason I haven't showcased it before is because, um, you know, I didn't have it. But since, you know, Memorial Day is here, uh, they added Marvel Girl back, uh, sort of sale, not really, but I bought her, so yeah, I can showcase her now. Okay, so Marvel Girl is in the pack with Jean, which means, uh, you know, she's a skin for Jean, um, but she is currently off sale, so they're only adding her when, oh, when holidays are here, like, uh, Christmas, I guessing, or Halloween, or, you know, all those types of holidays. So yeah, that is super cool, which is officially not off sale like the Phoenix, uh, but yeah. talk about how Marvel Girl looks a lot like Robin Hood. Um, she has that mask, please. Um, she has uh, the, uh, you know, she has a very cool uh, shirt. I don't know what you call it. Uh, a cool skirt, uh, a cool belt, and some cool shoes, uh, and uh, some cool hair, and some cool earrings, um, and um, uh, some cool details on her, which is actually different from Jean. So, look-wise, I would rather choose her, but powerful-wise, I would definitely choose Phoenix. Uh, but, you know, she looks really cool, you know, very detailed and nice, and yeah. So, the first custom thing about Marvel Girl is that, um, her flight is a little bit different. So, as you can see, that she has this little purple aura. Um, it looks super cool. It's very awesome and nice. Her eyes also glow, which is very cool. She looks very OP. Um, this is actually very pretty. Regular flight be boring. Yeah, to be honest, look at that. Like, pretty. Please. I mean, at least the gel, gen, gel, gem glows up, but the eyes are just better. Um, but her aura is really pretty and nice. And yeah. Another thing, or the last buff for Marvel Girl, is that her arms are, uh, as you can see, her idol as she's flying is a little bit different. Um, as you can see, there is this flight over here, um, but her arms are a little bit more, you know, like, closer to her uh, stomach. Um, yeah, more together. Um, so, that shouldn't really be there, to be honest, because nobody really notices it. I mean, I do like it a lot, actually, but, like, you, won't re you wouldn't really notice. Um, the only way you would really notice is if you look at their Trello or if someone else says it, because you wouldn't really notice if you just, you know, normally play as it. Maybe you will, I don't know. Um, but, yeah, they should definitely maybe add something else. Uh, but, yeah. Marvel Girl doesn't get any, like, bump ups or buffs like more damage or anything she just gets you know like boring stuff like flight that's the only thing really flight um and yeah um so yeah i guess that's all for this marvel girl showcase um i forgot to mention in the uh front part of the video i'm also going to be showcasing esme because this video was going to be very short uh, I will put the time stamps in the description below of which one is which, so you guys can see those, and yeah, let's just go showcase Esme. Okay, we are back. So yeah, we have the Esme skin. I'm going to be showcasing the normal one and the, uh, the, uh, triplet skin. Okay, so the first keybind is actually very cool. It's basically like a mind blast. So basically what you're gonna do is you're gonna hold a Q, and then you're just gonna click on someone. You have to wait for the eyes to glow or for the, um, little brain waves to show up. Um, it actually takes away a lot of damage for non-Robux characters. So as you can see, there's gonna be these crowns, there's gonna be this, like, little like waves emitting out of her brain and then you just click on somebody and as you can see it takes away damage for non robux characters like free characters it takes away most damage but for robux characters it doesn't take away too much so yeah this oh. is mind blast 
Another thing that it does, it can cancel someone's action. So basically, if uh, Mia is doing, or uh, Kyle's doing this, and I just hold Q and I click on her, as you can see, it canceled the action. Um, so yeah, that is super cool. I don't think they really meant to add that. I don't really know. I don't, I'm not sure. Um, but you know, it's still really cool. This power is actually very useful. They did, Kyle says. So, um, so yeah, that was Mind Blast, which is Q. The next power is actually very cool. This basically blinds the target. So you're basically just going to hold E and you're going to click on somebody. As you can see, they basically do this animation after you click on them. It basically blinds them for a few seconds, um, which means it's just going to show a white screen. This gives you time to run away or keep damaging them. They can't do anything. Like, they can't do anything while they're blinded, which is super cool. As you can see, Kyle did it to me and my screen is white. So yeah, that is actually very cool. Um, yeah. Next one is actually my favorite one. This basically pain inflicts everybody around you. Okay, so basically what you're gonna do is just gonna hold R, and as you can see, everybody around you is going to emit brain waves. Um, that means it's working. And as you can see, it takes away tons of damage. It does it, like, it pain inflicts everybody around you, and it takes away tons of damage. Um, so as you can see, Kyle is doing it to me! Oh my god, Sid is about to die. Sid, heal! Oh my god. Um, so, um, when, um, the pain infliction is done, you will basically just fall to the ground, go into ragdoll for a few seconds. Um, so yeah, that is actually very cool and awesome. So yeah. So, the last power for Esme, there's also this add-on, but the last power for Esme... Uh, basically, it's the same thing as R, but you can only do it to one person. So basically, what you're going to do is you're going to put your cursor on somebody first, and you're just going to hold F. And as you can see, you're pain inflicting them. It doesn't take away too much damage, but it takes away damage constantly. Um, and yeah, they just they can't move. They're going to go into this animation. It's going to take away damage. Um, so this is what it looks like when someone does it to you. As you can see, the screen is blurry. Um, so yeah, that is actually very cool and awesome. It doesn't take away too much damage like I said before. So yeah. So now for the last one, it is the inhaler. So basically what the inhaler does, I think it does two times damage. Um, and it also uh makes you like the distance is more longer how you can use your powers um but there is a long cooldown so watch that um but basically what you can do is just gonna click on this inhaler and as you can see all the colors are now brighter and basically if i go if i hold r right now as you can see from there they're getting pain inflicted which is a lot and if i hold e if i click um as you can see or uh, it it, it, as you can see, he's getting, you know, uh, blinded. And if I hold Q and I click, as you can see, it attacked them. So as you can see, it does have a small small cooldown, very small. Um, but one thing that's really cool is that their eyes glow red. So yeah, that's also very cool. I kind of missed that. Um, but yeah, it basically does two times damage, I think. And it makes... It, this the distance is more longer of how you can use your powers now we're going to go to the gifted skin so we are with the gifted skin and um basically the only bump up for this skin or first let's go just admire the outfit here like um so as you can see uh these are basically the triplet skin if you guys don't know what they are they're, they're an x-men um it's super cool it's really nice um the heels are just cool yeah um the pearl necklace is cool. Yeah, uh, but basically the only bump up for the gifted skin is that the cooldown is less. So as you can see, I'm going to use this and then I'm going to do this. And as you can see, the cooldown is only one minute and the normal cooldown is like 180 seconds. So yeah, that is a lot. Um, to be honest, yeah, I think the skin is like off sale forever mostly. Probably not really. Um, but, yeah. That is all for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. Hit the notification bell to get notified for all my videos and whenever I post. And share it to all the friends you have so you can make them happy. Because we love making people happy in this channel. <clears throat> and I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye, everybody!